Well, hello, you absolute legends. We are in the smart car workshop, and it's John here, and I'm just about to take it on his third round, first road test. Shut the window. Put it in reverse. We're out of here, we're out of the smart car workshop, let's go. On the first road test, since the engine has been fully rebuilt, I'm just gonna pull forward and back up a bit differently because it's quite tight. And the last thing I wanna do is crash it on the road test. You might be able to hear the engine, you might not. At this moment in time, this is my first time driving this car since Dad, in fairness, all of Dad has done for the past month is rebuild it. So I'm just gonna take it round the block just to make sure that that gear, or the gears, are actually changing. And you'll get to see a little bit of our local area as well. A little bit of Lincolnshire, it's a Cold January afternoon. At the moment she's sounding good. There's a bump. Here it comes. We'll go just down the road just to make sure that she's changing gear. And actually, this feels so alien to drive at this moment in time. It's just somebody coming, so we'll wait. You can see Mum's Hyundai there. If you've not uh, seen the video of me buying mum's hyundai for it and there we are we're out so out of reverse into automatic and she's changed up gear into second gear into third gear there's a little bit of a whine from the brakes because they are a bit rusty and actually the engine has got a much higher note it's got a bit of a whine I won't lie it's a bit more of a whine in what I'm used to but at the moment so far so good I'm going to put it into because we've got two modes on here so it's in third gear uh, we'll put it down into two. It's dropped into two. We'll put her up into third. Down into second. I'm going to put it back into automatic. It's got this semi-soft touch version of itself. It is so much more responsive than it was. It really is. And it's grumbling away. My brakes are really binding at the front because they're rusty as anything. Into first. Into second. Gently into third. There's a bit of a high whine. Not sure if that is because it is new. But so far, road test numero uno is good. So Dad's going to come with me now for the second part of the road test. I'm just going to go up to the local village and back. So we're on the second part of the road test now. We're on Lincolnshire's finest back roads. You can see they're all muddy and everyone's working in the fields. We're cruising at around 38 miles an hour. I've got Dad in the car with me as well now. And there is, there's a little bit of a metallic rattle as we pull away, something that's probably a little bit loose we need to deal with. There's a slow moving tractor. And when I put my foot on the brake, you can hear that they're rusty as anything on the front. Probably not picked up in the video, but 
certainly around here if you're. What do you reckon? So we'll turn around, this is our local veterinarian service as well. They're going to be pleased that they're getting a little bit of exposure. Spin around in their car park. And just give it a little bit of a turn around and then we shall go from there. But for our first, uh, first road test, and it is, it is genuinely the first road test. She's not doing too bad. No ABS lights, no warning lights, we've scanned the car, no codes. That wine is disappearing. Yep, the wine is slowly disappearing, that is right. There it was a little wine, it's slowly going and it's getting a bit more grumbly now. Not sure what this tractor's doing. He's spreading the squad in the house. In the middle of the blooming road, though, he's cleaning the roads up. Anyone that uh, what he's doing, he's levelling the squad, so he's probably been stood up in heaps. How's a moan about tractors? He's just levelling it out now. It's all fun and games in Lincolnshire. Well, I've got a. A mini driver that's right up my oh, backside, so I'm not able to uh, test the brakes properly because he wants to be in the boot of the smart car. Shout out to SCAC. We're doing 40, we'll take it up to 50. It's actually quite bumpy on this back road at 40 so we might not hit 50 there we are we're at 50 she's pulling away nicely at that we're in fifth gear we've got one more to go we're in sixth and putting the brakes on getting some some of that rust off as I say I don't want to drive it like a lunatic blow it up but at the moment everything's looking good 77,146 miles and the smart car needed rebuilding at that but dad has done it he's done the job the proof is in the pudding and I'm sure there might be some sort of niggles and some sort of slow time actions that we might need to deal with but at the moment we're back in business ladies and gentlemen